she's the creator of our funniest comedy characters. Now, Catherine Tate has been busy finding the voices of some new ones. Yeah, in her brand new series, she is stepping behind the bars to bring us a unique view of life inside a very dysfunctional women's prison. Just take a look at this. <laughs> Catherine, welcome. Thank you so much. You're so busy. I mean, the, the Nun movie came out. And yeah. Yes. This came out on Netflix yesterday, right? Yes, it did. It came out on Netflix yesterday. And the Nun movie is in, is in cinemas and that came out. Makes it look like I stacked it all up so I've got stuff back to back, but it was COVID that, you know, snuck in between it and made things a long time to get released. Are you, are you the kind of person that needs a little bit of solace, some quiet, peace and quiet to, to, to sit down and write, or does it all just come flooding out once you sit down behind a desk? Um, I like to write with people because it's, it's better. It's lonely writing on your own, you mm. know, and you can get... And I can get very, very distracted, so I prefer <laughs> uh, people around me who are more focused than I am. Right. So, how did you come up with Hard Sell, then? Uh, I just wanted to do a... a I, I, I saw a show years ago called um, Summer Heights High. I love Summer yes, Heights High. Yes. It was my favourite. Right. Yeah. Chris yeah. Lilly, who, is, who does multi-characters in a, in a school. And I wanted... I thought, oh, that's such a wonderful idea. I'd, I'd love to do something like that. And I came up with doing a show in prison ages ago. And then uh, when I pitched it, they said, well, there's this new show going out called Orange is the New Black. So it kind of got shelved for a long time. And then, uh, you know, then I was asked, do you want to do something else? And I thought, oh, I'll, I'll do that. I want to do characters, women characters. Where can they be? Put them inside. <laughs> <laughs> and they're all together, not going anywhere. Uh, but are, are the characters that you create, are they a reflection of the people that you know? Some personality traits of people that you know? Or... All, the, all the criminals I know. <laughs> well, <laughs> <laughs> but the way that you, that, that you portray them, you know, do you kind of think of people when you're, when you're acting them out? No, I don't. For my sketch show I did, I, I yeah. used to nick from people I know and love, but as long as you change their hair colour, they never recognise themselves. <laughs> <laughs> and um, <laughs> but for this show, no, I, I just we we just jumped in and thought, what 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 would what would be fun? Mm. How many characters have you got then, and, and how long does it take you to get into each character? Six. I play six in this season, and a lot, isn't it? it is a lot. Um, but it's um, most of them are prosthetic. All of them are prosthetic except the one that um, looks like me. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> and, um, <laughs> Uh, it was a long time. It's a long time in, 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 in makeup, yeah. When you shoot it, do you have to do each character scene there and then, or yes. do you switch up? No, you yeah. can't. It would take too long, so you have to do yeah. all one character in one day. But because my skin needs time to breathe, you have to have one day on prosthetics, one day off, you know, and stuff like that. Is it easier for you to write characters that you want to play? So, like, when you're writing, oh, I love this one. Yeah, I tend to give myself all the best lines, to be fair. <laughs> you're the star. You're the star. <laughs> I, don't trust your name in to lights, I don't trust anyone to deliver a punchline with me. <laughs> um, no. <laughs> <laughs> I feel like I gave people some... No, I'm joking. <laughs> what can you imagine? Do it more like me. Um, no, what was great was uh, have, creating, like, a family of people, a community of people, and all these brilliant women and a few gentlemen who came on, on, on set and just... I just said to people, Let, we, we're just going to play. We're just going to play. You know, just have a laugh with it. And loads of the stuff that we've got is, is improvised. And I had such a fantastic group of people around me. So th was the majority improvised then? No. Oh. No, no, I, I earned my writing fee oh, like, very well, <laughs> thank you. <laughs> we didn't make it up on the spot. No, 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 I, 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 I wrote it with my friends Alex and Nikki and... Uh, no, we, it was... It, that, but that's how you know you can kind of improvise, though, is when you know you've got a solid script. Because right. if you just go in and go, let's just muck about, I, you know, it shows, I think. But there's just stuff that we got... I was really keen that I wanted to do B-roll. Just get, grab people when they don't know you're even looking. You know, oh, nice. That's how you get the life of stuff, you know what I mean? But, no, it was all... It was so is it like you, you do the script the first couple of takes? Or, well, because you're a perfectionist, I would imagine it's one take. Oh, it's and then that. You, and then you say, right, play with it. Well, I mean, it's not like we improvise around the script. It was just like if I wanted to get a fight break out, you right. can't really script that too much, yeah, yeah. you know what I mean? You just got to... Or, or for, for like, some, some, some brilliant character who, actually, I wouldn't be able to say her name on... No, I could say her name. 
<laughs> but not her character's name, because everyone's right. got nicknames and it's a bit rude. OK, oh, yeah. Um, so I wouldn't be able to say what her nickname is. It's a holidays, is. Catherine. Yeah. Oh, actually, no, I can. She's called Cathy without the hat. That's all oh, right, isn't it? Yeah. yeah. No yeah. hat Cathy. It's because she used to be something else. OK. Um, and... <laughs> <laughs> Well, it's own way, so if, you, if you're confused as to what Catherine's describing, yeah. then you can jump on but the no, Netflix. No, we look. say it. We say right. one of the characters says she used to answer to this. I absolutely can't say it on morning TV. Um, but I said to um, Susie, the actor who's, who plays her, um, can you just do a mad dance down the ca canteen? And she did. She just did this mad tap dance that we've kept in, and it's just it's just stuff like that that you're so grateful that you're with people who just jump in and, mm. and do do stuff and. And I'm, 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 I'm really proud of what we've achieved. It's, it's a big ensemble, isn't it? It is, people. it is, it is. And that's the best way to be. Don't, don't ever be on your own. Mm. And Extender, Cheryl Ferguson, how did she get involved? She got involved because she's a brilliant sport. And I, I said to her, look, there I've... Oh, there she is. Aww. Well, that's, that's me. That's mm. not her. <laughs> <laughs> there, here we go, ready? There she there. is. <laughs> <laughs> Who does she play? She plays uh, herself. Oh, really? <laughs> she's yeah. um, she's, she's a version of herself. Brilliant. She's yeah. naturally very funny, isn't she, Cheryl, anyway? Yeah. No, she, she, she's brilliant. And I said, I want you to play a version of yourself because I want Cheryl Ferguson to come into this prison and uh, direct uh, a production of West Side Story. That's part of the, 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 the rehabilitation um, of these women. And... But I said, but listen, they're only going to call you Heather. They're only going to call you Heather Trot, and she was just up for it. And I, it's like I know that's probably because she probably gets shouted at in the street a hundred times a day, Heather. But that's what it would be like if she'd gone in in in, yeah, in, yeah. in somewhere. And I wanted to, to recreate that, and she's just brilliant. Yeah. Brilliant. Well, congrats on this yeah, series, and congrats you, on you. the Nun movie as thank well. Thank you. Thank you. Awesome stuff. Been busy. Thank yeah. You. So that was out yesterday. They can catch that on Netflix. Yesterday. Yes. Hard yeah, catch sell. it yesterday. <laughs> catch it yesterday, yeah. Yeah, go back. Go, go back, back in time. Yeah, oh. go back and catch it yesterday. Ah, thank uh, but you. it's out now. Uh, thank you very much, Catherine. <laughs> Absolute pleasure. Thank uh, you. I'm thank a joy you. having you with us. Thank you, thank you. Uh,